Hey V's fans, welcome to this week's edition of V's View. My name is Craig Boschman, joined alongside by the head coach and general manager Fred Harvinson. Fred, before we jump into last week's games, uh, Massimo Rizzo and Luke Reed are up at the World Under-17 Championships. Off to a 2-0 start with Team Canada Black. Have you been able to keep up to date on how they're doing? Uh, yeah, no, it sounds, I mean, obviously as a, as a team, uh, it seems like they're uh, adding to the mix there and, and, and definitely off to a great 2-0 start, so we're real, real happy for them. and. Uh, you know, hopefully they can continue the winning ways. Uh, last Friday, the team was in West Kelowna, battled back from down 2-1 and 3-2, but uh, over, the, over the course of the game, just uncharacteristic mistakes mistakes led to the final score. Uh, yeah, no, it's, uh, you know what, in both games we had opportunities to uh, to, to have 2 nothing leagues, leads, uh, both on Friday and Saturday night, and it just seems like uh, we're in one of those moments. Um, you know, it's, it, I mean, mo more years than not, it's kind of gone pretty smooth here. Uh, over my tenure and and uh, so this is good you know it's it's something for uh, you know last January we went through this type of thing and we had to find uh, to see if we had the right character in the room to fight through it and and right now that's what we're, we're looking for and, and you know right now when you look at it uh, in both games the Friday night game as you mentioned we just we found different moments in the game not to make the play and um, and they did and and at the end of the night uh, in our division, you're going to end up on the wrong end of it uh, when that happens. One thing I noticed a lot on Saturday, especially, was the use of five forwards on the power play, just trying to generate more offense. Yeah, just trying something different. I mean, we, you know what? It's it's funny though. You you get so wrapped up in talking about scoring goals, which everybody got thought it was kind of the cool thing to talk about last year. And uh, and geez, you know, they're not scoring enough goals, and the power play this, and the power play that. Well. Hey, you know what? We're, we're scoring on the power play a lot of nights right now, and we're not winning games. So I could really care less. Uh, we're giving up too many goals, and that's uh, something that's never happened here in my time. So um, we go back to basics. Uh, from what I can recall, we won a championship a year ago, um, winning low-scoring games, and, and we have to find a way to uh, keep pucks out of our net first and worry about putting them in theirs uh, second. No better time to turn things around than against a home-and-home -home series against Vernon. Yeah, well, you know what? If you if you don't can't if you can't get up for this, then then you're probably not a hockey player. So that'll be. Uh, I think it's better for us to. You know, we had a good meeting this week. We started good pra strong practice, which I thought we had strong practice last week. But um, you know, I think it's better that we have probably one of the best teams in the league in our building Friday, and then have to go there Saturday to to, to really keep putting pressure on ourselves because uh, it might get harder before it gets easier and, and that's what makes this fun. Well, as always, thanks for this and we'll talk to you again next week. You bet. Thank you. Did you know we have an obituary section? Click on the blue Our Town button in the yellow masthead to find it. <laughs>